It's the Mayor's Unsocial Network, a Facebook site where his view is the only view. The problem is when you try and censor social media, you, you might as well be stepping into a quicksand pit because you're going to go down very quickly. Mayor Tate's official Facebook page was supposed to show him actively engaging with his community, but when suggestions popped up that offered alternate opinions, they were deleted. Any politician doesn't like to hear people disagree with them, so they try and stop it. Post after post disappeared, enraging the authors. Darren Crawford said he asked three questions about the Commonwealth Games two months ago and didn't get a reply for over a month, and then was blocked from the site. If you don't want to hear what people have to say, then you shouldn't be on social media. It was only last week the Mayor slammed Save Our Spit for not allowing him to talk in favour of the cruise ship terminal at Sunday's rally. He said to be unable to put his point of view forward is undemocratic and he was not interested in attending a rally that presents a skewed perspective. The Mayor told us he suspended his official page after it was inundated with explicit posts. He says the Gold Coast can have its say in community forums or in the opinion section of the newspaper. It's a really great forum for him to figure out or learn what's happening on the Gold Coast and what people really feel. So instead of trying to block it, I'd be opening it up. Chris O'Keefe, NBN News.